Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Sean B. Sean Brooks, how you wanna call me? I prefer either or. Uh, but right now, we are gonna be sitting here bringing the 16 mil lens out today. I have to pick up some ingredients from the Fuse Water ad from my Boston client, Consensual Healing. I make sure I link the IG down in the below if you wanna check her page out and my page as well. Uh, <laughs> but nonetheless, uh, I gotta get the ingredients and I figure out what way to kind of test the vlogging capability of this lens by going to get the ingredients. So uh, let's see what this lens can do. We about to go, y'all. I just gotta help untangle my wife's anklet, our daughter. I do got a question for y'all though, while we sitting here trying to get this going. Um, what y'all quarantine been like? You know what I'm saying? Um, are y'all enjoying it? I've been noticing that people don't really like their family too much and haven't been really enjoying the quarantine. And I'm curious <laughs> to see if y'all like y'all family. By the way, this is on autofocus too. You all want, if you guys want, to kind of curious about the autofocus of said lens. That's what we're using right now. And boom, untangle. Let's go, y'all. So right now we are shooting an aperture priority. Uh, again, since I'm driving doing a vlog, I'm not going to use manual focus. I mean manual, uh, manual exposure. Uh, it's just I feel no need for that. Uh, but nonetheless, though, this is the kind of view or perspective you can expect using this lens in a car. Uh, luckily my wife was nice enough to drive for me so I can kind of give you guys some scenic views of how this lens will look. Now just in case you guys forgot, this lens is a 16mm f1.4 which is the equivalent of a 32mm in a full frame camera. So, so far I like this look and we are currently shooting at f2.8. So let's get some random footage and just see how it goes. Now, at first, I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. I was kind of concerned about vlogging and Target, you know, because my channel get demonetized, but I'm gonna use the Epidemic Sound Cloud music for my last channel, so my videos are getting demonetized anyway. Don't even matter. Also, by the way, I'm definitely about to open this aperture up. Um, I don't need the background to be this blurry. I know some vloggers like that, I'm not calling out no names, but <laughs> um, we're not that channel. Now, just for a reference point, just for you guys to know, this is currently at f2.5 the background still looks very blurry i'm going to crank this up to f1.4 just so you guys can get an idea how it looks it works but you know since you're manually exposing obviously your highlights are kind of blown out and it's just it's too blurry like you, i want you guys to feel where i'm at that's the point of vlogging so you guys get an idea where we are currently getting some alcohol for uh, the missus and I. It's been a little while since we got a little intoxicated. So, uh, hmm, what are we taking, a shot? That's what we always do. Big boy it is, man, guys. Big boy it is. Okay, cheers. Just do to yourself. The mic. <laughs> <laughs> kind of slammed back in my face. <laughs> wasn't uh wasn't expecting it as y'all can see. Uh but so far what you guys think about the picture quality? I mean, like again, what's funny is I think for this, like yo, if you have a GH5 and you want that bouquet look, this is the lens. As you guys can see, we're at F2.8 and we're still blurred out pretty like pretty pretty decently. Now this has nothing to do with the vlog. I'm just I used to review tech for those who don't know. And um you know, the S20 Plus came out or whatever, stuff like that. I don't have the phone, I still got the Galaxy Note now. But what I can say, 
doing quarantine, the Galaxy Note has been with the iris scanner because I can't use the I can't use the fingerprint scanner. So if I don't want to use my pen, I could use the iris scanner. I'm still good. So I don't know why they took that off. I was, I was we sitting here thinking like, yo, did y'all steal the egg? Surprise? Is that the surprise? Gotcha, bitch. This is right. <laughs> This is cute. Oh, baby boy, it's coming back. So the ingredients that I need are blueberries, limes, lemons, oranges, mint leaves, and a green tea bag. Mariano. Mariano's. It's limes at home, it's lemons at home. But this is for something separate, you know what I'm saying? I don't uh -huh. wanna. So, fun fact guys, it is now. Uh, hopefully, you can help. oh, it exposed correctly. Yay! Uh, after priority, um, <laughs> uh, it's raining. But luckily for us, the Sigma 16 mil is weather sealed, and so is the GH5, and also have the the, uh, the hood on the lens as well. But I will say this: I will say this. The mic is not weather sealed, so we won't be bringing. You know, it's, it's enough vlogging outside for right now, so we get back into Mariano. So I can safely say that. Nope. Take it's a so ticket. aggressive. Why can't you hide somebody nicer? <laughs> Please wait. Bitch, I said Let's see how the low light looking. I know that looking pretty, pretty good. So I can't crank that, crank it up. Ooh, looking good there, y'all. Hey, oh, we're not focused though. Uh, come on. Bow, got it. Damn it, we too far. Oh boy. My wife's being nice and picking up the ingredients for me because she loves me. So she says. All right, y'all, we got the mint. Let's go back to the wife. Let's see what I still need. We got mint, that's check. We got limes, we got lemons. I just need oranges and blueberries. So fun fact, this is at F4 because it was just the, the background was, I ain't needed that blurry. You know what I'm saying? I didn't need just enough. I'm sorry, this is the F4.5, but uh, we got everything we need so far. Uh, but I am curious, do you guys still like this look? Uh, I gotta do it one time for one time. We gotta see, we gotta see how it's gonna look at F1.4 with these lights. Do y'all see the vocal balls? Like, ooh, these hard, bro. Nah, I, just, look, I don't typically like this whole I'm popping out at you look, man, with the bokeh lights. Jeez, the little bokeh bar, they look hard, y'all. They look hard. All right, y'all, so for the most part, um, the little grocery store visit is done. Um, I got everything I need, but I'm pretty sure you guys are wondering how a cinematic sequence would look. For those who don't have a gimbal, for those who just kinda wanna shoot some really good B-roll with this lens, how does the depth of field look, all of that? Let's create something. So my preliminary thoughts about this lens, first use lens, first impressions. You know, this lens is fire, fam. You know what I'm saying? Like if you own a GH5 or any Micro Four Thirds system, uh, or even a Sony E-mount, this lens produces the bokeh that you're looking for. Like it's, the autofocus is really good. Had no complaints about that. Now I would say this, the weight, um, I feel like it's balanced. I feel like the lens is really balanced. With the lens hood, it adds like a little, you know, just a little bit, but not too much. But you do notice the weight of the lens. Okay, I will say that. But as far as everything else, like the, the look of the lens, I'm a fan, I'm a Sigma fanboy when it comes to lens. I think Sigma makes some of the best glass out there that you can buy. And I love the fact that because it's a 32 mil F1.4 and a GH5, now when I punch in and I sense I'm kind of getting the equivalent of, if I'm not mistaken, like a 50 mil with the punch in option on a GH5. I mean, like this lens, so, you know, again, this comes along how to work your camera, but this lens, in my opinion, is very versatile. Um, very, very dope. Just a very, very overall dope lens. I love this lens. Um, but I am curious, what did you guys think about the lens, like from, like what, from what you saw, right? What, are you con Were you considering picking up this lens and now that you've seen this lens, is it making you more inclined to buy it? Or, you know what I'm saying, vice versa. 
You know what I mean? When you looking at this footage, like, nah, I can't. This lens ain't what I'm looking for. This, you know, I'm very curious. So go ahead and comment down below. But if you enjoyed the video, man, make sure you subscribe. All that good stuff. Um, comment, like, you know, all the typical YouTube spiel. Uh, but other than that, man, we out. Deuces.